Good morning to you. Anywhere you are watching me from, may God bless you as you are tuning in. This is Linda's TV show. Here we bring information across the globe. We educate, inform the members of the public. If this is the kind of content you like, please kindly subscribe. Put on your notification bell to all notification. It will enable you to know when we upload a new video. I put a disclaimer that here in Linda's TV show, we do not preach misleading information. We do not preach hate speech. We do not preach violence. I don't love things. I will never promote them here. We do not instigate war or violence. And a call for self-determination is never a call for war and i want to seize this opportunity to appreciate you too for creating and allowing us to use their platform to disseminate information to the members of the public people party we are away today no we are that is the reason why when mass simon ever took over he looked at the failure of ojuku he looked at the failure of Wazirike. He looked at where Mazen Namdekano failed because this group of criminals, Mazen Namdekano did not fail in his own side, but this group of criminals who continue to work on Maze, making him to fail, if Mazen Namdekano plan, we are going to do this, they will work on And finally, when they cannot work on Maze, they made him to disappear. How did they make Mazen Namdekano to disappear? You are going to hear something that you never know today. Please pay very close attention. How do they make Mazen Namdekano to disappear? Ordinarily, where was Mazen Namdekano logging into Biafra Koto to broadcast on Radio Biafra? The person that opens Radio Biafra to Mazen Namdekano is the right person to know where Mazen Namdekano is. The app. That app that you use, or Mazen Namdekano uses to, to, to um, be on Radio Biafra, once you open it, it will read right to you the country which he is. So who is the people operating the Radio Biafra? Because they are the ones that communicated via Mazen Namdekano is to Uchechi, who then called him to come and pick him. Who then called him to come and pick her at the airport and there they disappeared man said, who? When Simon Eckman looked at all these failures, do you know what he did? He then go into this brain game and said, if we declare conventional war, where have we? It can never save us. If we declare conventional war, we are not going to be safe. How are we going to be safe as a people? How can we defeat our enemies? With our enemies. In this game of Ekoaka, in this game of Hallelujah, Hosanna in the highest, Kovanaka, Kovanaka, our people. He then sat down, calculated all the things. He said, okay, and we should go into Gorilla. He struggled and struggled. Mind you, all these criminals here, they we are the ones telling you, oh, Simon Epa is a nobody. Simon Epa have no key to the man on the ground. Simon Epa went on the ground. All these criminals insulting him today, they we are there saying he have no key to the man on the ground. Who does he know? Oh, he is lying. Don't you know when they are doing it? This man staying in Finland. How did he, have you asked yourself, how was it possible for him to dominate on the ground, staying in Finland? Mazen Namdekan on his own self, organized man coming down by himself. Organized man. But Simon Epa never came down on himself. He organized men from Finland whom he doesn't even know from Adam and he have not seen. Ask yourself, how was it possible? Are you people not using brain? Don't you ask yourself such a question? How is it possible? Mazen Namdekano did not stay anywhere to organize anything. He came down on himself. The first uh, this thing uh, that was found is BSS. Go and ask them. Ask anyone. BSS. 
before the military came, after the military invasion, and Mazin and the cargo escaped to um, Israel, escaped, escaped to Rome, from Rome to Israel, there was nothing called BSS. It was later chained to this Eastern Security Network that you see today. But ask yourself, how was it that Master Simon Epa created things? Master Simon Epa, who is not in Nigeria, who have not come to see the man that he wants to create, who does not even know the man that he wants to create, have you asked yourself, how was it possible that he created them? And I'm going to go into this today. How it was possible that Master Simon Epa created the man that he never see is the eager to achieve Biafra. How? The man who noticed that Master Namdekano was kidnapped, being the leaders of Eastern Security Network, noticed that Benjamin Madhu, who is the automatic commander, they leave over clothes, they started drawing who can we then trust that will oversee our, our collective effort for us to continue pushing this very struggle. They then went to Master Simon Epa and said, Le Kari, we are pursuing freedom in truthfulness and in all sincerity. So in the other way around, Master Simon Epa became savior to save the men on the ground because without him running to save the men, there will be no one to save them. These criminals, this one we in in the name of DOS would have triumphed over this man. So what he is to the man is savior. That is where the word savior, another savior comes to play. Now, going further, please, it is very important that you share this very program because you are going to learn a lot of things in this particular program. Going further, and there is something that I remember before I go further into this very program. I have now reached 42 live years, only 32 hitting the like button. You must endeavor to hit the like button. When you hit the like button, it gives room for people to join this very program. Endeavor to hit the like button, please. Once is when we hit the like button only once. There is something some people, there is something that PM posted yesterday about one group called Biafra is our home. Biafra is our home. People went and corrupted the, there was a Biafra is our home that someone added me into. People went and created another Biafra is our home to use that particular Biafra is our home to post something, to post rubbish. If you are in this very struggle, Chineke Yakoboko, if you are here to finish the, 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 the plans of people, Chineke Yakoboko, if you do not hide, hold your emotions and know that Biafra works with command and control, Master Simon Epa is the highest rank now. Any other person deceiving, any other person is just deceiving you. He is the highest rank. And what he says is final. And those of you who now create Kero Konya, Kero Konya, he will create platform Konya. He can create another platform just to blackmail that person. You must be careful because if you come with blackmail in this very struggle, I want to notice you name me blackmail. Nkegabo now, you must be white and whiter than white in order to stand and stay very long in this very program, in this very agitation called Biafra. And anything that you do, if you do not respect the PM, Chineke ya pogo kumeke, o ya pogo kunuri, o ya pogo kunangu afo, o ya pogo kunangu, o boa goku, o cha goku. Kama, ima kama, kama potazie, bebele ure sisiegi, the highest. Because karma, be careful in whatever you do in life. Karma stays and watch. Let us ride on in the program that brought all of us here, please. Let us ride on 
in the program that brought all of us here. Now, when Mazi Simon Eba took over, remember, it was, it was, he was on, 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 on a divine grace to save the men on the ground in order to continue their own pursuit for Biafra. When he took over, he then looked into it. Who are the men that we are Eastern Security Commanders? Ejiofo was a command. Ejiofo was a commander. Ejiofo was a commander. This Ejiofo you call barrister today was a commander. And what is commander? If you can go to the men on the ground and give command and say that uh, your talk is final, that Mazen Namdekano gives you the legitimacy to do that, you have become a commander because once you come, other commanders stand and give you that uh, salute. What are you? Chineke you are a commander. If your four was a commander in this very, very struggle, go anywhere and ask this criminal called a Jofo. Then when Mazi Simon Epa took over, he looked at who are the commanders of Eastern Security Network. A Jofo is there, Benjamin Madubu is there, and the rest of them, including the ones on the run, and then this uh, King Tiliani Bunagi, this one may pass. You know, you some people call this guy uh, Sapele the highest and the deadliest. Even Sapele them respect him. We are Sapele sleeping. Sapele sleeps in Ogoshi. We are in Ogoshi. It is in Kingsley Mother, mm, Kingsley Anebunam's house. That is where Sapele sleeps. The most fearful and dreaded Obu Mother in this very struggle. Obian Hakoga is Kingsley Anebunagi. Kingsley Anebunagi, that is the, uh, the commander of the then Dragon Sword. He is the most fearful and dreaded criminal in this very struggle. Burumu Madu, without any Hanyanas, having his own children, training them in school, but can Leon Madanando Obiana Hakoya because he felt that he had the power to do so. Am I speaking right here? I have now have 52 live views, only 37 hitting the like button. If you join, just hit the like button once. Hitting the like button is not giving me money. So that you do not fear that once you hit the like button, money is going to disappear from your account. It is a lie. Let me move on, please. So, when Mazi Simon Epa was able to notice that these people are commanders, he then started asking, how does the commanders, the rest of the commanders disappear? What happened to the rest of the commanders? It was when he knew that after the selling of Mazi Namdekano that most of the commanders were blackmailed, sold, and all of them were tied. He then looked into it. How we are they by? How can I be able to save the people, the remaining people? Because he's on a divine mandate to save the people. Do you know what else he did? He then created to distance, to put a demarcation between the uh, Biafra Liberation Army and the then Eastern Security Network, which has come under him. And these people are claiming that they are Eastern Security Network, but what they have is Dead Men's Squad, which they created when only do was even around. The commander of that very distant, the armed supplier, called me, Imane Oremijus, to convince me that I must join the DOS. I told him no. Do you know what Mazi Simon did? He created what we call Biafra Liberation Army. After thorough engagements, he declared Biafra Republic government in exile after thorough engagement with the Biafra, different Biafra stakeholders. 
So in order to uproot that land which the Bruten have created, in order to uproot that foundation of Nigeria, do you know what he did? Biafra people have now voted for referendum. So the legitimacy is there. The go-ahead order is there. We have given you the power. We are at your back. It is there. He created. Now we are going to what we call the last phase or second to the last phase of this very struggle. That is declaring sovereignty. If you do not declare sovereignty, you cannot meet anybody in the world and say, be at my back. The person that you are telling to be at your back, what is the person going to benefit from you? It, was, it is when you declare your sovereignty, you then go to countries, be at my back, support me. This is what you are going to benefit. Now, if Gaddafi, who is a nobody, who is just a common criminal, even in North Korea, a common criminal, after which he ran away, Biafra Republic government in exile sacked him. He was bundled over there, just like a common criminal. Only God knows where they don't drop him now. If Gaddafi, the common criminal called Gaddafi, can say that he go to people with the name of Master Simon Epa, he go to people. Just imagine how Nkrenka Gaddafi is. He was able to use that Nkrenka just with uh, the name, just the ordinary name of Master Simon Epa. That is Nkrenka Dnes. He was able to penetrate, or he and his likes, we are able to penetrate into some places that they promised them that they are going to give them. You see, to the party, AK, or I have forgotten. That means the name called Simon, it is name that you can use to go anywhere. If Gaddafi in his own cardness can penetrate with just that name, Master Simon Eba and the Afro Republic government in exile, and he was promised with people. So imagine if you declare your sovereignty and match with that your sovereignty to places and told them, this is what you want. Imagine what you can be able to achieve with your own sovereignty. So he understands the game very well. That is the reason why immediately he talked about declaring sovereignty. Nigerian government remembered that, oh, we can be able to pay all these women, pure, pure demons, called DOS, or you come back and do what? You know, the money that they paid them before have expired, all of them disappeared because there is no money coming again. Now you can see them, all of them is everywhere. Look at, oh, I have you imposed the money? Okay, I'm coming on live, I will broadcast. Hey, I am going to talk about Simon. Just imagine what that name Simon is. So he then planned to declare sovereignty. Once he declared this sovereignty with the press pressure of guerrilla warfare. Now let me tell you what this guerrilla warfare is. When we are, we are, we are, we, we are, and when we are, we are, we are, we are, we are, we are. Uh -huh. if you understand, you understand. Where we, we, we are, we are, we are, and when we are, we, we are, we are, we are, we are, we are, we are. Then it was thought on the men of where we are that uh, the anointing of gorilla, which gravitated into the speaking in tongues of falling some demons or delivering some demons under the anointing of Ratata. Once after speaking that in tongues, you disappear. And the demons, if they reinforce to come and attack you, they will know, not know where you are. They will not know where to attack because you don't have a place that they will attack. Now go to your Google and go and ask your Google what is the spirit, what is the gorilla, gorilla? I don't want we are on internet, please. What is gorilla? You understand? Go and ask your just add the other word, gorilla equaka in English. You add it in English. Gorilla equaka, 
Just go to your Google and ask. It is a form of Ekoaka Imevu. Ekoaka Imevu. That weakens the demons holding the contraption called Nigeria because they will not know where you are coming from. That was the that is the reason why you see Musa crying, saying these people we they don't know why it is very dangerous is because these people have no place. Once they are with gun, you know them. Once they are without gun, you don't know them. Am I speaking to you? If I am speaking right, can I hear you say, Papa, right on? Can I hear you say, Papa, pro? Can I hear you say, Papa, go on? And Papa will be riding on. And I am a man of Jews, known as the grace here, please. I speak the language of heaven. I speak nothing but the language of heaven. As the Bible says, you know the truth, and only the truth shall set you free. Those of you who know the truth and does not uh, believe in the truth, it is only the truth that will set you free. It is only the, it is only the truth that will set you free. Let me write on this very particular program, please. If I am saying your mind, can I hear you say, Papa, pro, Papa, write on, and Papa will be writing on. Now, let me go on. So when Biafra independent will be declared, it will then be to the final stage. Have you seen how Mazda Simon Epa is uprooting Nigeria? That is the reason why you see those who come back after the selling of Mazda Namdekano to tell you, eh, we are not going to do anything. Oh, if you do anything now, they will tag you a terrorist. It is because they don't know the way. Not even because they don't know the way, because they are sell out, because you don't know the way is another thing, but because you are part and parcel of those holding your people who say this is another thing. They are part and parcel of those holding the Biafra people who stage. They planned all of that. Francis Jack, I see you, please. They planned all of that with those holding the Biafra people who stage. And that is the reason why they can never do anything. Go and ask them. None of them can ever do anything because they are among the problem which the Biafra people are facing up to today. They are among the problem. So how do you do it? Master Simon Epa launched what we call Biafra government in exile. He launched what we call Biafra government in exile. Launched the Gorilla Ekwaka. Have what we call, have what we call, what are they calling it? Have what we call Biafra Liberation Army. So it is another face. It is a face very fearful to the enemies because they are shocked. How can this man be able to achieve all of these feats? We never know that they will achieve this feat within. None of them believe it. None of them knew that it will exist. Because they never knew the resolve of the people. They never knew what the people planned to achieve. That is the reason why they, they never believe that, oh, we are going to go far like this. That is the reason why when they see you going far, they are baffled, they are marveled. How are you able to achieve these things? How we are you able to achieve defeat? Focus on Biafra liberation with Master Simon Epa. Now, to the criminals who continue to tell you, oh, we are the right channel. You don't know the channel. I told you when Master Nam the Colonel was around, there are people who we are called the soldiers of justice. What are the work of soldiers of justice? You have soldiers of justice, you have Tony Abamu, you have all these women, all these criminals. 
what we are their work. Nigerian government paid them to be putting Sansan to be publishing lies against Mazen and the Kano, and they were doing it. When Mazen and the Kano was around, before the kidnap of Mazen and the Kano, you see Asari, you see Uwazirike doing oh my so oh my soul, every day. They will be Uwazirike employ the media to show that he is fighting for Biafra. Hey people, Mazen and the Kano. Every time it is Uwazirike who was there before Mazen and the Kano came throwing shed, not Mazen and the Kano throwing shed to Uwazirike. It is Uwazirike throwing shed to Mazen and the Kano. If he is doing well, can people have leave him to join Mazen Namdekano? And believe you me, Mazen Namdekano is not there today. Who was Ricky really have disappeared? Tony Nadi, who always go to U.S. Senate House. Oh, this is Tony Nadi. We have gone to uh, U.S. Senate. I am the one doing it. Have you seen Tony Nadi till today? That is the power of Nigerian money. Have you seen Tony Nadi? For whom we are bribed to insult Mazen Nam the Kano and to and to and to make us look foolish. Uchele for every time. Oh, this is to gather human rights radio because they told them continue oh, attacking Mazen Nam the Kano. All of them we are throwing shade at Mazen Nam the Kano, telling you, oh, we are the right, we are the ones doing it. Uchele for shamelessly. Imagine with Asari Dukubo. Imagine Asari Dukubo, who told you that they have launched the African summary government. He is the leader. That Asari Dukubo today is doing government. Have you seen the game that they have played to you? That same game is the one that they are playing today. All these games. It's the thing that they are still playing today. Then the soldiers of justice is telling you when this thing was going on, soldiers of justice we are there uh, tweeting, uh, posting, oh Mazen and the car is not the one doing it. He claimed the handwork of Tony Nadio. Tony Nadi is the one. He has created this and that. Now go and ask them, where is this Tony Nadi? It is now that you understand what I have been saying that Tony Nadi is Nigerian government. Nigerian government is Tony Nadi. Asali the Kubo is Nigerian government. Nigerian government is Asali the Kubo. Because once they were done with the effort of kidnapping Mazen and the car, they disappeared. Who was Ricky disappeared? To think eh, all of them disappeared. How about for it? Thinking that all all are gonna. Where they saw another walk. Now they cannot be able to recall Tony Nadi. Do you know why? If Tony Nadi comes back to start the same thing that he was doing, you will ask Tony Nadi, where have you been all these years that Mazen Nam the Kano is not there? They try to use Tony. Tony came back. But once he came back, they used, they sensed the mentality of people. They said, Tony, come and sit down. This work will not pass you your own time, don't go. Come and sit down. They now said, okay, we are going to pay these people money. They paid more money to the criminals in the US. Imagine the people being sacked by Mazen Nam in the car in 2022, still claiming that they are defending Mazen Nam the car. Imagine. What are they calling him? This boy, this boy, this is very dirty. Is Nkogiri Burunne Nnewi, Nkushogiri Burunne Nnewi. Imagine him on his program. He will say, "We are defending Mazen Nam the Kano from Simon. Simon Ebi is trying to take over. Simon Ebi is working with your of them. Go and ask the Kokiri Burunne Nnewi. He is now singing Hallelujah of your of them, which means it was your of them that sent them because they bribed it. Now, in the other way, they told you, oh, he have resigned from IPOB. Let me tell you that there is something called resignation. Oontu Mokuruago does not resign anywhere. He is working with the criminals in the US. But why are they making it to look as if he have resigned? It is because if he is still, if they are still telling you that he is working under the US, you will not, you will cut them very easily. To be, so in order to confuse you, in order to confuse you, because um, Nkana Ujele, the one called the Jele, his work had been relieved. They went to suffer him to buy him over there. So they used Obotunu Rado to replace the Jele, because all of them is working and doing the same work.
He said, not these people, when William Joe was around, they were saying, he told them, we will buy you, we will do this. After the kidnapping of Mazen and the Kano, do you see them posting in jail? All of them are doing the same work. Now you can believe when I tell you that Simon Eba uprooted Nigeria from the foundation, demolished Nigeria from the foundation, because that work and what they planned against Mazen can no longer hold water. They, it can no longer hold water. That is the reason why they can now gossip anywhere that you see them. They have become Gossipers Association of Nigeria. Anywhere you see them, you see gossip. And by the way, this gossip, they cannot do better than soldiers of justice. They cannot do uh, better than uh, Tony Nade. They cannot do better than Omi uh, Omi. They they cannot do better than a manager. They cannot do better than uh, 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 what are they calling him? Nkoba. Um, Nkoba. They cannot do better. It is thought rubbish and disappear. But in this case, why they are different is because under the name of Mazen Namdekano, because they agitated that Mazen Namdekano must remain in DSS. Do you know why they want Mazen Namdekano to remain in DSS? Now, I will show you something. If you go to all the videos that are pumping up from prison, you see people smuggling phone to prison, telling you, now, let go to know, let go to prison, I know, Paranka. Under DSS, you cannot do it. You cannot smuggle anything there. Because from where you take up, people will search you, search you, search you, before you get to where you are going. But in prison, you can give one prison mother. He will tell, ask you, what are you doing? Oh, I want to smuggle phone to this person. He will tell you, okay. 100,000. Once you give it to him, he will collect the phone from you and take it to the person. You don't need to smuggle it. He will collect the phone from you, take it to the person. And in this case, I told you that these people understand how Mazen and the Kano coordinated IPOB from inside prison. And they never wanted that to happen. That is the reason why they agitated that Mazen and the Kano must stay inside DSS. They went extra mile to humiliate him the more. They planned this humiliation long time ago. That was the reason why they started murmuring his wife. Now so who the you kwa? And now my you kwa. He put him pocket. He put him pocket. He put him pocket. He put him pocket. I'm not the do change you kwa. I'm not the do change you kwa. I'm not you kwa. She she now became a thorn in her husband's flesh. And I will prove it to you. I have always said this. For four years, Mazen Namdekano have been behind bar. You have not seen Uchechi. Mazen Namdekano used to go to court. You have not seen Uchechi in the court. If you have seen, come back, I will know. If you have seen Uchechi in the court, say, and I challenge her to go to court tomorrow, open court and stay. Obron Uchechi appear in open court if Mazen Namdekano did not see disgrace her. I will stop broadcasting here on this very platform. She should go to open court. All this one, she, all these years, she is lying to you people. My husband, after my visit, she never visited Onyendu going to four years. So to humiliate Mazen and the Kano, they planned and set Uchechi up because they know her as a mini opponent. She has been doing it. After all, she schooled with a Jofo, so a Jofo knows her capacity, her equal capacity. They are in. That is the reason why she is at the point of no return, because of the cliffs that they have. She never wanted it to come out. She is at the point of no return. Just keep on blackmailing your husband. Oh, now, after visit to my husband, Ashiocha, she never visited my husband, the Kano. That was the reason why she is warning a lawyer in Jamaica. Don't say anything pertaining to our family. Everything was got to be your ass, a liquid appeal. Nara, as in the one here, but I'm not my here now, but I'm no, Nara, but due to freedom is involved. And that poker psyche wants to claim the freedom. They want to claim the freedom. 
Only not on his units. Only not on the other units. Wants to claim only freedom. I am when I give her freedom. Am I speaking right, please? Am I speaking right? Are you understanding the enormity of this very program? Now, when Nigerian government see that they made a very grave mistake by kidnapping Mazen Nandekano, they employ the services of these criminals that you are seeing today, who are there deceiving you. Oh, after our visit with Mazen Nandekano, well in turn, they have never visited. After doing this with Mazen Nandekano, well in turn, it was a lie. After doing that with Mazen Nandekano, when they know that they are lying, blood, broad daylight lies. Deceits to deceive some of you. Broad daylight lies. Deceiving some of you because they know that some of you people are ignorant. Some of you people doesn't know what they do. So what will they do? They will always sell broad daylight lies to you. They will always sell broad daylight lies to you. Am I preaching here, please? There is. Uh -uh. Why is it that I never see this time? No wine here. No wine here. I'm coming. Please, I am coming. Hmm. Now, wow. now you know I don't look for you, I never see you. That is the reason why. They have been selling broad daylight lies to you because they know that you will believe any nonsense which they put out. Now, when they see that, oh, we can no longer defeat Master Simon Epa, they are paying these blood sucking criminals to be deceiving you always. Simon Epa, yeah, very much. Simon Epa worked with Nigerian government. Tomorrow, Simon Epa worked with Hope Osadima. Next tomorrow, they will be thanking Hope Osadima. Thank you for distancing yourself from Epa. Oh, Nigerian government, thank you. Bring Epa back. The same people they tell you that he is working with. The same people are thanking the same people, telling them, oh, thank you for distancing yourself. Tomorrow again, they will start. Oh, he is working with them. Oh, he is working with them. Next tomorrow, they will start thanking them, praising them, telling them, oh, posterity will never forget you. And in this case, the Nigerian government, this criminal foundation called Nigeria, the people you employ to do damage control, and criminality are not intelligent people. If they are intelligent people, they will not behave the way that they are behaving because all their propaganda lies and deceit. Biafra people can see within the right handwriting. They can see, they can figure everything out and they can know that these people are criminal. These people doesn't we can never work together with these people because they are criminals, they are liars, and they are deceivers. From me, from here. I bring you the greetings from the great seer and from Ohane Zendi leader. All eyes and all focus should be on December 2nd, For it is because of that December 2nd that Araji Abandara. After December 2nd, you are going to see propaganda. But we are here. Ordinary, my little broadcasting here. 
They retire them. Then they retire. Immediately they see it to their liver, the court. This guy again, what can we do to this guy? Because of this guy, we cannot focus. Oh, there is no way that they never shout my name. No place they never put this name. The same people telling you that Simon Eba is uh, Nigerian agent. My name don't reach everywhere. My picture don't reach everywhere. Oh, this is the criminal working with a criminal. But uh, Simon Eba is a Nigerian agent. But now you, when you be Nigerian agent, now you they carry pic people picture, they report to the same Nigeria who are whom Simon Eba is working for. And now them they in charge of kidnapping our people. No, now go still come tomorrow, come celebrate. Oh, all the people working with Eberima is in different prison, is in different police station. The same people that you said, the same person you said is Eberima. Now you come the jubilate, you say people where they work with them, they inside prison. Because you are not reasoning fine. From me, from here, follow who no road. On your name, when he go, Jana, he may change. On your bot, Anna, her money, I can have. On your grish, Yana, as I look. On your name, Muni, Anna, as a hygiene. Ah? Onyara ana akwaza wisdom. Maka wisdom e be ko ye she enwete e be kwen ko ye she afopota. Fulu hu no road. Fulu hu no road. And not a if you follow them, you are stupid because the only thing that makes you to follow them is the common hatred against the person that you are, uh, uh, against the, the person that they are running propaganda against. Otherwise, you will follow them by their own work and not by propaganda that they are running. Am I right or wrong? Fulu who no road from me from here. With Thank you so much, my wonderful viewers, for watching this video together with me from the beginning to the end. Like I said before, if you like what you see here, if you like what I do in this platform, as you have finished watching this video, please hit that red button that says subscribe and put on your notification bell to all notifications. In that way, you'll be able to know when I upload a new video. Share my videos, leave your comments in the comment section constructively. Until I meet your way again in my next video, I still remain your Linda's TV show. Bye-bye.